Our daddy gave his life in the line of duty and we are so proud of him. We are so proud of him. We are so proud of him. And I want everybody to know that you didn't just have, you didn't just have a, a man out there. You have somebody that loved what he was doing. He touched me. Yeah. He, he really touched me. And um, the Bible says you'll know my disciples because they have loved one for another. Mm -hmm. And he loved people and people loved him. One of the best memories I have of my dad is probably waking up in the middle of the night and hearing him praying in the living room. Yes. And <laughs> I think if, if, if I didn't learn anything, I learned about a relationship with Christ. Yes. Because of that. Like it was, it was routine just to wake up in the middle of the night and hear him my praying. dad would be praying <laughs> in the living room. When it comes to my father, I think the word that it has been expressed the most is selflessness. Mm -hmm. um, and that selflessness is, I've, I've gotten in contact with a lot of people who maybe he, he's been on EMT rides with or he's helped. And a lot of people have reached out to me and they talked about how he's always had a smile. He's given him a Bible verse. He, he prayed with them. Um, and I think for him and also uh, the entire fire department as a whole, firefighters, paramedics, EMT, I think they all kind of display a class of a selflessness to they have to be on the front lines and they know every time that a phone call comes that potentially it's something that's life altering for them and so my father exhibited that that spirit um, it's something that we definitely try to incorporate in every area of our lives that selflessness he loved to bowl he loved to go fishing and we went fishing with him all the time even if we were better than him, he still tried to show us what to do. <laughs> but we love Daddy for that. One of the things that we do is we give up our heart. Um, we don't look for anything in return. That's what Daddy taught us. Daddy taught us great ethics. Daddy called, taught us great morals. Daddy taught us how to be quiet, even when your mouth wants to say something. And one of the things that my brother said, which is so true, from doctors to nurses to registrants, they were like, oh my God, your daddy had a smile all the time like this job didn't affect him, like it wasn't taking a toll on him. And I know that's because of his love for Christ, his love for the ministry, his love for people, that he wouldn't allow it to affect his life. We just want to thank Kansas City as a whole um, for loving on my dad. Um, we want to thank Kansas City as a whole for all the good things. We want to thank Mayor for the beautiful things that he also said about my dad and um, just the things that he wrote. It's, it's amazing to us and we just love him. And um, we just want everybody to know he wasn't just somebody that was doing a job to get a paycheck. He did his job because he loved it.